Andre van Barneveld from Grace Consultancy. I often get asked by farmers, what sort of stocking rate can I sustain through the time that I'm closing up long-term silage um, or taking out ground for reseeding? And I always respond, it's really important not to talk about stocking rate, but to talk about pasture demand. What sort of demand can you sustain through that period and to set that demand consciously? So the first thing to do, to do is to work out through the period, if it's through the time of first cut silage, you may be able to comfortably sustain a, a pasture demand of 65, 70 kilos of dry matter per hectare per day. And so you need to consciously set that at that level. That's the first thing. You need to work out what the realistic level is so you don't end up with shortfalls. The second thing you do is to work out your total daily pasture demand, right? So you need to then work out the cow numbers times the pasture per cow per day, and that can vary from, from fully fed on pasture cows at 18 kilos of dry matter per cow down to whatever, if you're feeding a lot of supplements uh, and concentrate, they may only be getting 12 to 14 kilos of dry matter per cow. That's why it's important not to talk about stocking rate, but pasture demand, right? Th then you... Take your total daily demand and divide it by the demand per hectare per day you're trying to set. And that tells you how many hectares you need to sustain the cows through that period. All right, so for an example, if you want to set your pasture demand at 60 kilos of dry matter per hectare per day, and you have 100 cows and you're, and you're planning to feed them 16 kilos of dry matter pasture per cow per day, 1,600 kilos of dry matter per day demand divided by 60 kilos of dry matter per hectare per day, equals 26.7 hectares, right? So to set your demand at 60 kilos of dry matter per hectare per day, that is what you need as a milking platform. Take out the remaining area for reseeding or for um, silage. And, and within that, you're still gonna grow surpluses and you may uh, need, to, need to still take out some bales or anything like that to manage those surpluses. But that's how you consciously set your pasture demand.